Today I will show you how to transform this image and give it a richer tone using Snapseed. This video is brought to you by Usana. Choose Usana for a healthy lifestyle. Your health, your life, your way. Okay, so una natin gagawin, open lang natin yung free app na natin, Snapseed. Actually guys, you can easily download it ng Play Store. It's free, so download nyo lang yung Snapseed. Okay, so mamimili tayo ng image. So itong structure na to ang napili ko. Then I will go to Tune. I-tune natin yung image ng konti. So i-adjust lang natin siya. I will go to Tools. Then I will use Selective Tool. Okay, so ilalagay ko siya doon sa, ano, sa may sky. Okay? Then I will increase the brightness. And a little bit of saturation. Tapos, uh, lalagyan ko rin ng Selective Tool yung, ano, yung structure natin. I will also increase the brightness. And I will add Structure and saturation. And I will make a copy. Kasi paste ko lang yung ano, yung effects dun sa baba. Tsaka dun sa isang structure pa. After that, pupunta ko ng tools. Then I will use curves. Tapos, I will use luminance. Kasi increase ko siya ng konti. Tapos, doon naman ako sa red. I-increase ko din ng konti. Then, I will choose blue. And, I will drag it down. Since, ang opposite ng blue is yellow. So, magkakaroon ng parang orange tone yung image natin. I will apply. I will go to stack icon on, on the top. Then, view edits. Then, I will brush the effect on the structure. Ayan, so guys, para makita nyo kung ano, kung tinatama, kung nasan yung effects na nilalagay nyo, um, itik nyo lang yung ano, yung eye icon sa baba. Ayan, so may kita nyo kung saan um, nagkaroon ng effect. Okay? So kung buburahin nyo yung effect na yun, isirin nyo lang yung percentage, tapos burahin nyo lang yung mga excess. Ayan guys, so very user-friendly tong Snapseed. So, I highly suggest na i-download nyo siya kasi napakaganda niyang gamitin at saka napakadali lang. So, kung may tune kayong image, um, meron ako mga videos ng Snapseed kung paano aayos yung mga underexposed at overexposed or using double exposure. You can also watch that video. So, I suggest na ano, napag-aralan ninyong gamitin itong Snapseed. Okay, so I will go to Tools. Then, I will use Brush. Doon muna ako sa Saturation. Tapos, in-increase ko siya by 5% ng style strength. Tapos, pwede na siya dun sa structure. Okay. Tapos, pupunta rito ako sa brush. Tapos, I will use exposure. Tapos, bababaan ko yung strength para mag-darken siya. Tapos, i-darken ko lang yung ibang part ng building. Okay, so pipindutin ko naman ngayon yung dodge and burn. Tapos i-lower ko yung strength. Tapos ibabrush ko siya dun sa, ano, dun sa foreground. Saka dun na rin sa ibang part ng building. After that, I will go to tools. Tapos alagyan natin siya ng temperature. Doon tayo sa may white balance. Okay? Tapos, a little bit of tint. Para magkaroon siya ng warmer tone. Okay, so I will go to tools again. And then I will choose details. Then I will add some structure to the image. And also a little bit of sharpening.
Okay, so now, pupunta ako sa tools. Then, pupunta ako sa vintage. Then, I will choose some presets. Ayan. So, um, gagami gagamitin ko yung preset 12. Pagkatapos, pababaan ko ng konti yung style strength niya. Tapos, increase ko ng konti yung vignette. Okay? Okay. Ayan. Tapos, itune ko yung image ng konti. Increase ko lang ng konting-konti yung ano niya, yung brightness. Tsaka, increase ko rin yung ambience. Para lumibarag yung image natin. And that's it. We're done. Adding a richer tone using Snapseed. Thank you for watching.